Passing through Arafin and Catholic, Lynn and her friends arrive in Kaelin. However, Kaelin is now under the rule of Lord Lundgren. Already? Lundgren's henchmen lie in wait to assassinate Lynn. They wait for her approach and ready a special weapon. Oh boy, this sounds interesting. Anyway, it's time for... T or... Chapter 8, Vortex of Strategy. This sounds interesting. We didn't do Chapter 8 last episode. So, just a warning there. Oh, there's something bad over there. Look, Big Al, the mountain seems so far away now. We come such a long way. Milady Witness, Big Al! We can't be very far from the castle now. By my reckoning, we can reach Castle Kaelin in two days if we hurry. Two more days. Hold on, Grandfather. Please. Cheer up, Lynn. If they see you looking so sad, the entire company will lose heart. Florina. You're right. There's nothing to be gained by worrying. We just have to press onward. That's the spirit. Lynn, danger approaches! What'd you say? I don't see anything. Are you sure? I feel it too. I'm sure of it. Ah! Milady, don't move. Hmm? Um. Whoa! Okay, what the? What in? Where did this bolt come from? They have a ballista. Lord Grungrin is getting serious. Deploying siege engines is no mean feat. Where's a ballista? It's a weapon designed for long distance attacks. Only archers can use them, but they can be devastating. Foyna, you must stay aground. Do not take to the air. The ballista will target you in an instant. Is there a way to combat it? The safest course is to use someone with good defense as bait so the enemy wastes arrows. Then you can walk up and knock the fool in the head. Well, can you use a ballista? I've never tried, but it's just a really big bow, right? I should be able to figure it out. <laughs> All I can ask is that you try. Let's see what we can do. Oh, whoa! Hi there, Matthew! <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, Lady Witness, Big Al! I have some minor business to attend to. I'm unable to join you. If you need any of my possessions, please take them now. What? Why can I not use Matthew in this chapter? Okay, so Matthew is instantly out. We can pick nine, eight units. And naturally, we're gonna use the whole squad we got here. We're gonna take the hammer from Matthew. And give it to Dorcas, because he can use that. Let's see. But first, let's, as always, take a look at our enemies and see what we're handling here. So we got this dude over here. This archer with the ballista. That's a bit of a problem. We got another archer. So we kind of want to keep Florina at bay for a little while. Got this guy with the lance. This guy with the lance. This guy with an axe reaver. What? Okay, I'm guessing that means good on axes. A sword reaver? So they're like the dual katana weapons. Yogi <laughs> with an axe reaver. Oh boy, that means we're gonna have to go in with Lin and use that armor slayer. But anyway, in the meantime, we have a shaman and a regular mage over here. Okay, let's see what we got. An armory. All right, we're gonna have that armory real quick, and then this village. This map does not look fun. All right. Let's do some item management real quick. You have bull noise. Uh, we need to get some more lances up in here. Let's see. Alright, first we're gonna get that frickin' hammer for Dwarkus. And increases HP by a maximum of 7 points. I want to check everyone's health real quick. 21... 23, 25, 19, 23, 30, 18, 15, 18. Um, 
I think I have everyone. I'm gonna use that Angelic Grove on Florina, because her health's kind of the lowest, and she has that bonus weakness to bows, which can make it quite a problem for her. So, we'll give this to Florina. And use this on you. Will you really use it? Yes. Alright. I think we're ready. Let's save it up real quick. And, let's get into the action. On the far side of the hill to the south is a ballista. As Ken said, it's a weapon intended for trained archers. The attack range of the ballista is extremely large, so it can fire on enemies at great distances. As they can attack without fear of counterattack, they're quite useful. To use one, move an archer onto an occupied ballista, select the right command. After that, you can attack as usual. Ballista can also be moved while in use. Additionally, Ballista can be used by any archer in the field. So if you can remove the enemy man in the Ballista and move one of your group onto it, you'll find it most useful. Alright, well first off, we're gonna need to get over there. We're gonna keep Florina as far away from him as physically possible, however. And we're gonna get Lucius. We're gonna have Lucius and not Dorcas. We'll have Sane start heading for the village while the rest of the squad goes to deal with the ballista. Real quick, Florina, what do we have here in the armor? Ooh, we got bows! I kinda wanna buy another bow for Will. CC Cleaner update! Be right back! I swear, I always get interrupted by something. We don't need another Iron Lance, because we already have one for Florina. But we want to keep you far away for now. So you're just gonna chill out up there. Okay, let's see. What do you have for weapons? You're good. You're good, because you have another iron sword. Yeah, you're fine. We can't buy stabs here. I do want to buy another bow for Will, though. I'm going to waste Dorcas's move to go to the armory and buy another bow. Nah, that's all we need. Alright. When you can start moving up. We want Will to get that ballista, so we're gonna have... N FUCK! I ACCIDENTALLY USED NILS ON THE WRONG CHARACTER! Oh, That's probably gonna cost me a little bit. You're gonna chaw there, Wynn. Can't you just start moving on forward? And Sarah, you just do your thing. Okay, okay, here they come. Here they come. What, what is that one dude doing over there? Oh boy, they're cavaliers. Oh boy. Wow, he missed. Oh boy! Oh, you only do three. Eh, I don't like the odds of that. Because here comes the shaman, too. Yup, here comes the shaman! He's doing a lot more than drops three! Miss. Okay, perfect. Oh, and oh, it's not the right All right, Will, shoot this. Yeah, he dies. Oh, that's decent damage. Bye. All right, get Will all that experience. I'll try getting Dorcas over to Will so we can give him this item. Lucius, absolutely eradicate this guy. Power Crush spells you! This is gonna do his Dark Mage Bolt Strattery. Wow, we're in a hit, bro! Bye! We're kind of running kind of low on lightnings, however, so I'm gonna need to be more careful with use of those. Saying you keep on moving towards the village, and we need to take down this Ballista, like yesteryear. Nils, actually. Well, actually, wait. Wait, 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 back up. We're gonna be smart. First, we're gonna heal... Will. Because next time we can just heal Lynn. Get all this experience for Sarah, and then we'll have Nils play for Will, so that he can start making his way over to the Ballista. And once Will's on the Ballista, then he can just start going ham. Oh, wait. Does using the ballista take up a... No, it doesn't. Okay, perfect. I'm one tile 
off! When you just go here. Who hasn't moved? Alright, Florina. But you're gonna keep the rear. What are you curse waiting for? They're nothing but these! Call off for reinforcements and rush them! Oh boy. Reinforcements? That doesn't sound great. Okay, that axe guy's walking on the water. Okay, these cavaliers are in a dangerous place. Ugh. You missed again. Get good. Okay, this, this archer over here is coming up from the corner, and I don't like that. First, do we have any way of reaching that? Nope, I think we have to go around. But let's visit the village first. Do you remember the weapon triangle? Axes over lances and one arm! This important, so pay attention, Sonny! There are some weapons that don't follow the normal rules. This here last dreamer is one of the use. It's a sword that reverses the triangle. So if you wield this blade, you can best a lance with it. Oh, of course it's outside. Axis can best this sword. Take this as a gift. Do a reward for listening to an old man ramble. Don't be so shy. So I can, can use the thing. <laughs> no one can wield a sword of this caliber. I'm sure you know someone who can use it though. Alright, we got Lance Reaver. So we have a sword that can work on Lance... Not even bad. Dorcas, my man. Can you hand axe as man? You can. You can. You can. You can iron axe him, but that's just a waste of time. So we can hand axe this guy. Let's do it. E. Get Dorcas all this experience. Then, we can have Will literally fuck the rules and hit this guy from a distance. Yeah, we're gonna... I think we have to go around to reach the other guys. 16, you do 5. Alright, I have a new idea. I have a new idea. Will can be a bitch and hit this guy from a distance. Good. Now Lin kills him. And your weapon level increased! Not even bad! Good work, Will. Or, we can have Lucius... If only I had that javelin. And I have Nils on the back burner, too. Okay, this is gonna go perfect. WHAT?! just happened! That literally just happened! Fuck me. That literally just happened! That literally just happened! You saw it here, folks! That just happened! Oh, you don't kill him! This is bad! You need to land us, Will. This man! This man! Is dodging me! Like a... Oh my god. Who's yes? You critting him? Yes, you are. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Can't. I swear to god. Why do you not reach him?! Why? If I wait, wait, I can actually, I can actually just fuck the rules and yeah. Why didn't I think of this before? Because you can't reach, reach what's her name, Florina. Now we just need to get Will over there. Oh, now I wish I could heal Lynn, but I can't. Fuck. This literally just happened! This literally just happened. Wait, when did those guys spawn in? Those guys spawn in at the end of the turn. I love how this dude can just walk in the water like a bitch. Oh, yes! Good! What?! What?! Win! Hit him! Thank 
you! Jesus! Girl! Oh, you're gonna actually do a thing. Never mind, you're not gonna do a thing. You're bad. Get good, scrub. Okay. Okay. Do you have the thing? No, you don't. You don't have the thing. Dorcas, my main man! Can you destroy this guy? Not that guy. This guy. You double him? With the hand axe? Bro, go for it! Get bodied, scrub! Good work, Dorkins! Level 5! I don't even like the fighter class that much. Alright, well, buddy, pal, dude, bro, man, can you kill this cavalier over here? No, you can't. I established that already. Clearly, I'm not paying attention to my own place. But we can! What we can do is literally slide over here and not kill him with a javelin. And kill this guy with a... Wait, actually, I have an even better idea. I have an even better idea. I double this guy. I could try to kill this dude with Will, and if I fail, I still have Nils in the back burner. And if I kill him with Will, then I can move Lynn over, kill this guy, and have Florina deal with this guy. And then I can have Sarah heal Lynn because her health is getting kind of low. Bro! I start to get the other. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. What the fuck is happening here? What is happening here? What is this disaster that we are in right now? I'm trying to think here. Like, I don't want to waste Lynn's attack on the chance I'll miss. I don't want to waste the Manicotti- oh, wow, the Manicotti's hit rate is even lower. Yeah, we're not even trying that. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do plan B. We're gonna do plan B, folks. Have Kent shut this lance up this man's ass! There! Dead! Problem solved! Crisis averted, folks. Oh, now we have problem child number two. This bitch here. What do you have equipped? A lance. I could use Dorcas and rip your face off. Actually, let's use Dorcas and rip your face off! Alright, Dorcas, go for it. Tear this man to shreds. Thank you. My god, all this effort just to kill two guys. Like, I know I'm not the most strategetic strategist in the history of strategy. And then you die, because Flinner doubles you. Six HP is a small price to pay to kill him. And she gets leveled too, even better. Level 5 on Florina. Not even bad. Wish you got more strength growth, but whatever. Alright, now for real. Let's heal Lynn. Not Kent, Lynn. Because she needs it more. Okay. Now, there's the matter of this here archer here. 24. Yeah, you're dead. Don't even, don't even try it, man. You're dead. Bye. Well, actually, I have an idea. Sane can literally slide over this way and go down and pick off any guys that get in his way. Meanwhile, we can have Lucy's going this way. Alright. Okay, yeah, more guys are spawning in. Bro, go after Sane. I do not care. 3 HP? Yeah, it's a small price to pay, but you're gonna die now. Scrub. Okay, we got four lancers here. Four. 
plus these four guys over here. I want to get Will on that Ballista. Let's play for Will. Oh, I forgot to give him the bow again! I gotta remember to give Will the bow. So he has more bow use. Let's give it, the, give it to him now. Will can continue making his way down towards Mr. Uh, Ballista. We can have Sarah heal Florina. Cause she kinda took a few took a little bit of a beating. Sarah, you need to get the marbles, girl. Girl. Kent, you can come down here. Lynn, you can join him. Okay, never mind, you can't. Lucius can't either, because narrow pathways. And Florida can literally slide down here and probably kill one of these guys. Single-handedly, but we're not going to do that. But Zane's going to do... Wait. Wait. This mountain? Yep, never mind. Zane has to go around. Rip Zane. Alright, you all going to come up and try and kill Florida? Yep! I didn't know you had that much range! God damn! Well, you're still dead. I'm pretty sure I double you. Yep. Alright, here comes the next one. You can't reach me. This is promising. This is promising. Nails, what's your range? Okay, I have an idea. We're gonna move Dorcas there. And we're gonna move Nils here. So we can play for Dorcas, and Dorcas can go over and kill that guy. You see, we're making massive plays here, folks. And Nils is almost level 3. Because now we can come over here, and we can Iron Axe this guy in the face, and then he dies. One hit! Oh wait, nope, two hits. And... Catch crit! Just one more step close to getting Will to that ballista. Uh, let's see. You can't heal far enough, but you can heal Kent. My god, I wish you had Vestals in this game. Like, literally, I think I've been spoiled by Fire Emblem Fate and Vestals. Because Vestals actually have range when it comes to healing. Yes, it's hard to imagine. I, it was hard to imagine for me when I played Fire Emblem Fates for the first time that there were stabs that had range. Because I was so used to Fire Emblem Awakening and their stabs not having range. Well, they had range, but not much. You know, Florina, you actually just chill back there. But, but, oh, fuck, I just forgot. I left Will in the line of fire. Oh, whoops. Oh, I'm sorry, Will. I'm so sorry, Will. I'm so sorry, Will. Okay, now my Kent's. Kent's doing. Kent's gonna put nothing but the finest to work. You double him. You do. Thank you, Kent. Putting in nothing but the finest to work. All right. Dorcas. We can get on this ballista. Let's see how far we can attack. We can attack this guy. We do 14. We can attack the boss. Let's sack the boss. Curses! The ballista must have been taken! What's going on here? Somebody get that girl! Catch damage. Good work, Will. Alright, and now Dorcas can absolutely assimilate this man. Bodied. Bodied. I like this hand axe, but we're running low on uses of it, which is kind of sad. Alright, Lynn, keep on moving forward. And... Florina, you need healing more. And then we can go and heal Sane. Alright. This plan is working. Surprisingly. I don't know how, but... You know. We're managing. Can't you fool? Lucius, we need to get you some more action, man. And Sane can just ride on down here while we use Nils to play for Sarah.
Cause just think about it. Look at how many times I've been using the staff. Like, look at our staff! The first one! We already only have five uses left out of it. And it's the first one we started with. Anyway, let's see what I'm saying. Get more experience for Sarah. This is like the only way to raise up your healers, folks. And you want to raise up your healers. Because if I've learned anything from Fire Emblem Awakening and Fire Emblem Fates, it's that healers somehow become fucking god status. Alright, boost around two, let's attack this guy. Damn, he's almost dead! Literally, Florina can slide in and kill any one of these guys. Like, you do zero. Like, this guy. She could kill that guy. Or we can just send in the rest of the squad. You know what? Let's send in the squad. I think it would just be better to send in the squad. This could get dangerous, actually. This could get dangerous, actually. I feel like I have more units than this! I don't know why, but I feel like I have more units than this. I'm either hallucinating, or I have more should have more units than what I feel like I have. When you look at them all close together, it feels like you don't have anyone on this chapter. My god. Ooh, I could heal Nils and get more experience for Sarah. I mean, Nils and Sarah are getting all this experience. You know what? Actually, yeah, let's do it. Actually, no, I'll go to Dorcas. He's one of my main fighters. Oh, one more heal. One more heal. And Lucius can just slide on down there. Are they gonna move? Oh shit, they are! Oh shit, you do a- Never mind. Bye. <laughs> Having magic users is fun. Okay. Oh god. Actually, this guy's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt! Never mind. Bye! Oh, you didn't die. Lucius putting in the work. Well, actually, I kind of can wonder something. How much does Lucy do at the boss? <laughs> okay, well, that answers my question. He dies. And we can... Wait. We're gonna play this smart this time. We have an armor slayer. Oh my god! That did way too much. Lord Lundgren, I failed you. I pray you hurry. With those reinforcements, you promised. I'm guessing one Gren was being an asshole today, and he wasn't gonna bring reinforcements. Anyway, Lynn is level 8. If we had an ability to reclass her, we would be able to do so in two more levels. Oh my god, the wind just got nothing but body. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Oh my lord, oh my damn. Lottie. I know I'm saying a bunch of- Oh, nope. Nope. <laughs> We're not doing that! We're using the lance! You barely even hit me. Good. Adios. Catch a lance to the face. Okay. We can actually- Let's waste this last ballista shot on this one dude, even though it's probably gonna miss. Never mind! <laughs> Let's go! Anyway, is it over? Yes, I see no more enemy soldiers. However, something is bothering me. What is it? I noticed it during the fighting. Our opponents. They were soldiers of Kaelin. I even recognized some of the foes we fought. I trained with many of them. And yet they attacked us without hesitation. They're black-hearted traitors to join Lord Lundgren. Good rinse, I say. That also means less resistance at the castle. I hope you're right. I'm just glad Nils and Ninian were with us. If that first shot had hit me, I might not have survived. Your honor just served you well. We won't let you down. I know, I'm relying on you. What's this? You dealt with the ballista too? Nicely done! Matthew, where were you during all this? I went to the village to sniff out for information. I got some interesting news for my trouble too. Let's hear it. 
first about Marcus Kalen's illness. Oh, this sounds bad. He really is unwell. He's been in bed for nigh on three months. Oh no. Grandfather. I heard an interesting rumor about his condition, though. The people believe that someone's been poisoning the Marcus. He's been poisoned? And this someone? Well, everyone's too afraid to mention a name. However, they say that as soon as the Marquis took ill, a certain noble took control of the castle as though it were his own. I can only imagine who that is. I fed a hungry innkeeper some coin and he fed me a name. The Marquis of Caelan's own brother, Lord Lundgren. How can this be? How can they allow him to get away with this? The villagers know he's the one poisoning my grandfather, and yet no one raises a hand against him? Why? They are afraid, and they lack proof. The whispering of the common people mean nothing. That's the truth of it! And of the Marquis's loyal retainers who might have went credence to those ru these rumors, there's no sign. Are you saying they've been silenced? It's a fair assumption. It's beyond believing. The worst news is yet to come. There's more? What? There's more? Thank you, Sane! An imposter's appeared, claiming to be the Marquis's granddaughter. At least, that's the story Lundgren's telling you all who looks and... What does that mean? It means that people are waiting for two traitorous knights and a base-born child to appear and lay claim to Castle Kaelin. But, but that, it can't be! Traitors! Us? Ridiculous! He says, I'm an imposter? Don't you have anything that proves your lineage? My mother joined the Lorca. She brought nothing of all I see it with her. Milady. Marcus Arafin himself remarked at your resemblance to Lady Madeline. Your face is your proof. They'll say we found a look like somewhere. We're seen as betrayers of our knightly vows. Our word means nothing. No, our only hope is to see Marcus Kaelin himself. I must hurry, not my grandfather. I must see him, my last breath if need be. We must formulate some manner of plan, even if we sell for the castle. The troops patrolling the area will cause no end of problems. You have been branded as Oathbreakers, after all. I got it! Elliewood! He seems sympathetic to our plight. You should still be in Kathleen. If we can talk to him, he might help us. Of course! A sound idea! Let's hurry! Yes, back to Kathleen. So... One grand the ass clown is screwing us! That's basically all I got from this. Lundgren is screwing us. I had a feeling something like that was going to happen, but... Looks like we're going back to see Elliewood again next time on Fire Emblem. So I will see you guys then, and hopefully we'll be able to destroy Lundgren soon enough. I will see you guys next time.